Hello again, YouTube. It's Jeremy X here, and what a thing to come home to. Yeah, I know it's just been a few hours since my last Yu-Gi-Oh! unboxing, but when I just got home, this was waiting for me in the mail. Legendary Dex 2. This time with Brooklyn and Douchebag. I ordered this from an English supplier. I forget the name off the top of my head, but I'll put it in the description panel below. Anyways, I got this thing for like 23 bucks, and this is some pretty sweet stash we got here. Got Yugi's Exodia deck, Kaiba's Blue Eyes deck, and Joey's Red Eyes deck. Sorry if the frame is a little off. I'm hard to see into the camera when you're trying to tilt it really high, you know. Oh, and don't mind the noise in the background. That's just my dogs. All right, Exodia the Forbidden One, Blue Eyes White Dragon, and Red Eyes Black Dragon rebuilt for the modern dueling era. As if people actually give a crap about the ban list. You were right, Aaron. Or soon to be not Aaron. Anyways, yeah, this is definitely looks a lot more like Yugi's puzzle box than the last one did. At any rate, let's open this up. Let's open this bad boy up and see what we got. I mean, it's a given what's in there, but my sister got this about a week back and wouldn't let me have even one look at it. I'm supposed to be, and I'm supposed to be the Yu-Gi-Oh nut here. But her boyfriend's getting into a Pegasus cosplay, so, eh, whatever. Alright, let's see what we got here. These are our brand new exclusive cards. Dark Burning Attack, which is pretty much Raigeki for Dark Magician Girl. Dark Burning Magic, which destroys all cards on the field, or at least on your opponent's side of the field, but only if you control Dark Magician and Dark Magician Girl. Thank goodness they put the original art for Dark Magician in this. And Eternal Soul. So yeah, this is pretty much the card that every Dark Magician user like myself has been waiting for. This, it's, it's just Mahad's palette, his stone tablet with Dark Magician. Oh, this is such good stuff. Anyways, this is all going inside right here. Oops, tilt the camera. And this is it. First deck is Yugi's deck. With all three tournament playable Egyptian god cards and all five pieces of Exodia. The only question is, how are we going to... Aha! There's the strip right here. Let's see. Aha. Ugh, plastic. Okay. Cypher the Sky Dragon. Obelisk the Tormentor. The Winged Dragon of Ra, baby! Legendary Exodia Incarnate. Yeah, this is the new one. Ties of the Brethren? Oh, they finally made that a card. Obliterate. That looks like a nice card. Exodia. All five pieces. Exodia Necros! Man, I haven't seen that since Gozaburo in Season 3. Let's see. Dark Magician, Dark Magician Girl, Buster Blader, Silent Magician Level 8, Silent Magician Level 4, The Tricky, Big Shield Gardener, Magician's Valkyria, Blast Magician, Blockman, Marshmallow, Sangan, Gold Sarcophagus, Swords of Revealing Light, Magical Dimension, Magicians Unite, Tricky Spell 4, Thousand Knives, Dark Magic Attack, and of course, Contract with Exodia, because, you know, we have Exodia Necros. Messenger of Peace! Talk about a callback! Dark Factory of Mass Production, Monster Reincarnation. You know, I'm surprised I didn't run this in my old Exodia deck. Let's see. Secret Village of the Spellcasters, Pot of Duality, Mirror Force, Magical Hats, Magic Cylinder, Magician Circle, Backup Soldier, and Gravity Bind with the, with the Yugi Moto token. Alright, let's set that aside and dig into Kaiba's deck. And of course, the first card we see is him in blue eyes, and that's pretty much Kisara in card form. Oh goodness, that ship. 
Let's see. Let's see, we got Maiden with Eyes of Blue. The Melody of Awakening Dragon. Oh, I remember that one from the R manga. Blue Eyes Ultimate, all right. And all three artworks for the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Dragon Spirit of White, Kaiba Man. The White Stone of Legend, the White Stone of Ancients. Ooh, that's a new one. Uh, Protector with Eyes of Blue, Master with Eyes of Blue, Battle Ox, Legin, Force Raider, Alexandrite Dragon, Blade Knight, Ancient Lamp, Tiger Dragon, Kid Modo Dragon, okay, King of the Swamp, oh yes, that is good stuff, Rider of the Storm Winds, you know, I didn't know until now that this technically qualifies as a Blue Eyes card, well, sort of, I mean, it's... It's like they're the servants of the blue eyes or whatever. Let's see. Burshima Destruction, Beacon of White, Mausoleum of White, Polymerization, Enemy Controller, Shrink, Silent Doom, Ancient Rules, Traden, Where Arf Thou? Oh my goodness! It's, 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 it's Marin, that cute little dog. Pot of Dichotomy. Oh, so that's what Pot of Avarice. That's pretty much Pot of Duality, but with Pot of Avarice on the other side. Fusion Substitute, Unexpected Die, Negate Attack, Final Attack Orders, Shadow Spell, Cloning, Fusion Reserve, Jar of Avarice, Azurai Silver Dragon, and First of the Dragons. Ooh, this is interesting. And of course, the Kaiba Token. Now we're getting into what I like about this deck. The fact that it's got a Joey deck. Yeah, I know a lot of people are not that big of fans of Joey, but I always liked I always liked the underdogs. Plus, even though I like Kaiba's monsters, I really do not like his personality. Much respect to you, Eric Stewart. Let's see. The Black Stone of Legend, Return of the Red Eyes, Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon, all right. Red Eyes Black Dragon, Red Eyes Black Flare Dragon, Red Eyes Archfiend of Lightning, Red Eyes Retro Dragon, Black Metal Dragon, Axe Raider, Alligator Sword, Baby Dragon, Jinzo, Goblin Attack Force, Gear Freed, Rocket Warrior, Blue Flame Swordsman. Okay, that's interesting. Time Wizard, Phoenix Gear Freed, Gemini Summoner, Blazewing Butterfly, Dark Valkyria, Command Knight, Valkyrian Knight, and Keeper of the Shrine. Oh, huh, this is in this is very interesting. Inferno Fire Blast, Red Eyes Fusion, Cards of the Red Stone, Polymerization, Salamandra Scapegoat, Callback Time, baby! Foolish Burial, Roulette Spider! I didn't know they printed that! Oh, and it's determined with a die roll, that's interesting. Supervise, Mystical Space Typhoon, Symbols of Duty, Red Eyes Spirit, Kunai with Chain, oh, that was a good Joey card. Call of the Haunted, Torrential Tribute, Burst Breath, Curse of Anubis, Archfiend Black Skull Dragon, and Alligator Sword Dragon. And the Joey Token. Well, for those of you who actually got the decks before me, you all would know that, but I really like what I got out of these. I mean, it's not just for the God Cards, it's not just for Exodia, it's not for the Blue Eyes, it's for the nostalgia that comes with all three of these bad boys. So anyways, that's all for this video. Hope to do more. And I hope you all enjoyed me rambling on like this. I'll make more content to come. Hopefully Aaron and I will get around to our little Yu-Gi-Oh! corner. And so for now, this is Jeremy X signing off. Good night, YouTube.